Ladies and gentlemen, get ready for the greatest showdown ever. Whose AI drives better in the wet? Forza Motorsport or Gran Turismo 7? For those regular viewers to my channel, you will know I do quite a lot of videos at the Le Mans circuit. If you're new to the channel, well, obviously, as I've just said, I do a lot of videos at the Le Mans circuit. Why? Well, firstly, because it's one of my favourite tracks, and secondly, it's probably the best place in Gran Turismo 7 to earn credits. But, since Forza Motorsport, or Forza 8, has come out, obviously, I've been spending some time there and checking out their version of the Le Mans circuit, which, by the way, looks fantastic. But, the other thing is, those races are always versus the AI, and my driving hasn't changed, I'm still, well, average. But, has the AI changed, or are they different between the Forza version and the Gran Turismo 7 version? Well, there's only one way to find out. Okay, let's start off with a bit of Forza, following the Lambo, as we come down to the first of the chicanes at Le Mans. And, um, okay, bit of a dive bomb by the NASCAR there, but that's not bad. Yep, they're all on the track. They're all facing the same direction. So, yeah, that's not too bad, really. And as we come down to the second chicane, again, not bad. They're all behaving themselves, all under control, and all still facing the same direction. I will just take a moment here to point out that this is Forza's heaviest weather setting, or as it's known by its name, Rainstorm. And for this clip, we'll follow the Corvette as we head up to and into the Porsche Curves. And, well, that's not too bad. In fact, I've seen human players go through there in the wet, <laughs> driving worse than that. So, uh, yeah, I'll give that a bit of a thumbs up. And just before we jump to the Gran Turismo section of the video, if I could ask if you guys would consider hitting the like and subscribe buttons, I do appreciate it, and it really does help out the channel. And as we jump to Gran Turismo 7 and the end of the straight at Le Mans, well, um, yeah. Well, that's not the best start, is it? Oh, no, no, no. Well, never mind. Maybe it was better down by the chicanes. Oh, or maybe not. Oh, ah. Hello. Oh, dear. Well, never mind. Maybe it looks better from on board with a Mustang. Oh, or maybe it doesn't. But, let's be fair here. At least the Super didn't hit. Ooh. Well, anybody else? But this, this is one of my favourite shots from the entire video. Because, um, yeah, it looks more like a car park. <laughs> Maybe it looks better down by the Porsche curves. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> oh, look, a Lamborghini. <laughs> and it's not even just around the bends. They're not that good in a straight line either. Hello. Don't get me wrong, I am still very much a Gran Turismo fanboy. But, in the case of this particular video, I'm afraid I'm going to have to declare the winner, Forza Motorsport. Oh, the shame. And, as Forza was the winner, I guess it's only fair that we see out the video with a bit of Forza footage. Now, if you have enjoyed this bit of fun video, please remember to hit those like and subscribe buttons. And I will see you guys in the next video. For more great videos like this one, follow this link. Thank you for watching and I will see you in the next video.